Wagner Group leader wants F-35 fighter jets. Yevgeny Prigozhin, the leader of the Wagner Group, has said that 32,000 former convict fighters from his private military company have returned home after their contracts came to an end. As of the 18th of June 2023, 32,000 of the people who were previously convicted and participated in the special military operation on the territory of the Luhansk People's Republic and Donetsk People's Republic in the ranks of the Wagner Group have gone home at the end of their contracts, he added. According to Prigozhin, 83 crimes were committed by these former convicts who completed their contracts, which is supposedly 80 times less than those who were released from prison over the same period and did not enter into a contract with the Wagner Group. Besides, Yevgeny Prigozhin has asked Politico media outlet for help in equipping his Wagner private army with Lockheed Martin F-35 fighter jets in a sarcastic voice message delivered in response to a request for comment, Prigozhin also sought assistance in obtaining US-made sniper rifles, machine guns and grenade launchers. I ask you to talk to your contacts so that we can get these supplies, said Prigozhin, whose mercenaries have fought at the forefront of Vladimir Putin's war in Ukraine. I have one more request for you, Prigozhin continued. So, F-35s, if it's possible, as we previously discussed, to buy up supplies via New Zealand, they may need to refuel in Hawaii, but I don't really foresee a problem. Prigozhin's statement appeared intended as a joke. It was delivered in a jovial, ironic tone. So, I shake your hand. Huge thanks for the questions and I hope you respond to me. Obviously, about the deliveries of the F-35s, respond in a private message, Prigozhin added. And in a parting shot, Prigozhin said, Buddy, I completely forgot. If the deal goes through, my own Orsis rifle will be my personal gift to you.